Hey everybody, it's me, Briggs. Holy shit, it's been a long time since I've done one of these videos. I don't even want to check how long it's been, because if I do, I'll feel really guilty about it, and um, yeah, don't want that, do I? Um, so this is kind of just a, an update video to say, hello, I'm still alive, sort of thing. Um, I can't remember what was going on last time I did a video. Um, but I suppose I'd update you now, really. Um, life is going alright, working solidly, which is really good. Um, and for the most part, I'm enjoying the work I'm doing, which is good. Um, there's been several ups and downs this, this past few months. Um, unfortunately, my um, grandma in Belfast died uh, a few weeks back, so obviously very... Um, unhappy and, and sad times but um, she lived a very full life and um, yeah very um, very sad to see her go obviously went over to Belfast to see all the family which is really really good to see it's a shame it had you know it had to happen on a day where um, we were coming together for the wrong reasons really but it was good to see all of the folks um, over there um, yeah, it would have been nice um, for everyone to have been there. Unfortunately, we were missing a couple of people that it would have been better if they were about, of course. Um, but there's, there was there's very little you can do about that in the end. Um, we, um, I think we we celebrated a life pretty well, and and and. We, we were able to talk to each other, all the family was able to get together for the most part and and it was just a it was just a nice afternoon after, you know, a bit of a sad morning. So yeah, um there's not much else you can really say about that. Um what else has been going on? Um my my work is still the same work I was doing last time we we um I say we had a conversation this is kind of a bit of a one way conversation but hey um last time we um or at least I did a video I was working um you know quite solidly I've been there a few months now I I'm still there working um enjoying it doing everything you know I feel everything is is going very well. Um, things are progressing. I'm, I'm getting more and more experience doing doing what it, you know, the administrator role. Um, you know, it was it's it's been a it's been a good past few months. Um, absolutely. Health wise, um, I'm doing okay. Um, I'm, I I had obviously my issues back in back in April, um, of which I've talked about before. Um, they they are now pretty much settled in terms of I am now healthy, which is great, obviously. Um, but I have I'm having niggles here and niggles there, and and I could be fitter and I could be eating better and and. Because we we are coming up to three years, three we, three years next week, since I had my surgery, to to better my life, as it were, in terms of the the change, the changes that um, I felt were I needed to make in my life, um, of which I think I've I've I think I've made the the right changes if I'm honest um, so yeah um, it's, it's, it's at these times where you think back to those days and you think you know how could I let it get on for so long and all that sort of stuff and you kind of question a lot of things that you've been doing um, and I think that's one of the reasons why also I'm back playing this game you can see in the top up here, this is um, Championship Manager 97-98 it's one of the 
my my kind of all time favorite games that I've played for hours and 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 hours and, hours and, hours and even more hours and hours and hours and it's one of those um, it's one of those silly things where you think to yourself how how can this still be good how can the game still be good even though we're talking 20 almost 20 years since this game came out in fact it's probably it's probably about 20 years if 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 this came out in 97 then this game is 20 years old now some of you who are watching this video i don't know my how many what the age range of of my viewers are because i don't really have many viewers but i honestly can't imagine that there are people there may be a couple of people under the, who weren't even born when this game came out so anyone who knows this game also knows that you pick a team that you can win with um, hence why I'm Manchester United even though I don't particularly like Manchester United in any way if I had my way I'd be Newcastle United but they aren't very good at the start of the game and you kind of gotta you kind of just hope that you don't get absolutely smashed when um playing this game to begin with. With Manchester United you can pretty much just win straight away. I won the treble in my first season and I'm, I'm hopefully, don't want to drink or anything, but hopefully about to do another, at least a double. Uh, as you can see, you may just notice that there is a, a player here called Briggs. Let's put him on here. Alexander Briggs. I wasn't born in 1981. I was born in 1985, but that would make me too young to be in this game. Let's put it that way. As you can see, I'm I'm an all right player. I've not I've not given myself stupid stupid um, stats or anything like that, but I'm 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 half decent. Yeah. Um. Should have scored then. So yeah. Um. I better take myself off actually. If you come to think of it. Um. So yeah, you know you look. I I, look, I always seem to. I'm see. I seem to be very retrospective in in my life at the moment. I'm thinking because it, it's coming up to Christmas. I know I hate to use that term Christmas, but I'm coming up to it's coming up to Christmas, and and although I don't really want to think about Christmas, I'm now having to think about Christmas, and that always reminds me of past Christmases and all that sort of stuff and you can't really go you can't really go five minutes without thinking about something that's happened in the past around Christmas and and so you know in, inevitably you will I always feel that look Christmas is always a time that I always tend to look back because there are there are, I have had some decent Christmases I think everyone has decent Christmases they have good years and bad years but Christmas for me has always I've always been a bit miserable over Christmas I don't Maybe that's just me being a bit miserable just in general. So yeah, um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to um, play Alan Shearer instead of myself. Um, so yeah, I've said so quite a lot. So, so I'm playing this game as you can see. I'm also playing a, a couple of other games. I'm playing um, Transport Fever, which is like an, a, a transport tycoon type game, which I'm really enjoying. But it's very much a um, nice, nice job, Shira. Um It's very much a case of of I come home from work and. I see what my brain wants to do. Does it want to shut off, or does it want to think, or does it want to does it want to play something about blowing stuff up? And but at the moment, it seems to be let's let's kick on with this the this for a little bit, um, or build some trains, or or crash cars into each other. Because the other game I'm playing is the next car game or wreckfest, as as some would call it. Um, so yeah. 
Yeah. So what else is going on other than Christmas? Obviously, approaching quicker and quicker and quicker, and it's it's one of those um, it's one of those things where it's it, it's it's now in inbuilt on every person who has any form of family in their lives that you need to spend money to to have a better Christmas and I don't like that feeling not because I don't want to spend any money um, but just because it's one of those you when 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 you don't earn very much money and you've got other oh shit if you've got other things that you need to kind of be doing it's um it's very difficult to 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 really spend loads of money on trivial things like presents for people and and cards and and that sort of thing just because, I mean, not because I, I'm trying to be Scrooge or anything, but it's because you think you think to yourself, especially for kids, I find kids nowadays are really spoiled. And there's no problem with that. It's just sometimes I feel that you're almost spending money for the sake of spending money. And it's like, well, maybe that's not the best way to, to go about it. Maybe we could be a bit more focused on on the other things like spending time with each other and all that sort of stuff I mean I'm not very kid minded but if I if I felt that by buying something I would or I would you know if I was buying something for someone I always like to buy things people need rather than people what people want or I think might want um, which I mean some people would say Maybe that's not a, the way to go about it. Maybe, maybe it should be that you you do it at the kindness of your own heart because you want to to give them something they want, something that makes them happy and such. But I I often feel that giving buying something or giving something to someone that they need and then they can use for the rest, you know, use for periods and periods of their life. Then I think that to me that's a better. It's a better present. You know what I mean? I I, I feel and and so and stuff that can people can use for long for long periods of time as well. Bloody hell! Oh, Schmeichel, you big knob! What? Who am I going to have to sacrifice now? I suppose I have to sacrifice um, one of my strikers. So um, yeah, I don't like doing Christmas cards. I think Christmas cards are a waste of um, it's a waste of of time and effort and because unless you're oh fuck's sake unless you're sending a Christmas card to someone you haven't seen for years or some or someone really far away that you can't s send a present or anything like that to. Then, honestly, I I just don't get Christmas cards. I don't understand, and I'm just thinking to myself, is it honestly is it worth it? And I know a lot a lot of people out there will say, of course it's bloody worth it. Of course it is. How many goals do you want to score, Bert? Can't bloody hell. He scored five goals. Anyone ever scored five goals in the Premier League? In in one game? I'm hesitant now to do anything. I might just let him play. Um, so that's that's it's one of those questions, isn't it? Anyway, um, I'm going to draw this to a close because it's been going 50... I've just been sitting here eat, drinking a cup of tea and talking absolute shite and playing Championship Manager 2 or 97, 98, I always call it. He's got six now. Bloody hell. Um, so, yeah. Um, 
I hope everyone's okay. I hope uh, life's treating everyone all right. Um, and I um, wish you all the best. And if I don't see you before Christmas and the new year, have a fantastic Christmas and New Year and holiday period and festive festivities and all that sort of stuff if, if you indeed celebrate that stuff um, and I will see you all in the New Year ish we'll see I'll try and I, I always say this I'll try and do more videos about stuff at some point but time is just one of those things that I don't have that much of anymore so we'll see anyway thanks very much for watching folks and I will see you all very soon hopefully take it easy goodbye